Hey guys, this is Comic Uno, and today I'm a review for Dr. Fate issue 1. Before I start talking about Dr. Fate, just want to give you guys a couple updates. Of course I have Comic Uno episode 102, and that's the show where I review all the comics I read this week in one show, and here are those exclusive comics. We got Fathom Blue, Fathom Blue issue 1, um, Grim Fairy Tales issue 111, Superman Wonder Woman issue 18, Wonder Woman issue 41, Harley Quinn Power Girl issue 1, Big Thunder Mountain Railroad, Issue 4, Revival, Issue 30, Doomed, Issue 1, which I also have an in-depth review on Comic Frontline 4, and Miss Marvel, Issue 16. So if you want to go check out all, all those reviews, go to Comic You Know, Episode 102, which is annotated. But let's talk about Dr. Fate, Issue 2. 99. Uh, kind of cool cover. It's like you got this tile type thing of, uh, of the subway, uh, so it seems like Dr. Fate lives in Manhattan. Um, actually, I think he did say that he lived in Manhattan or it was like Brooklyn or something. So you have the subways and you have the tiles of the subway here. So I thought that was pretty cool uh, with some uh, graffiti. So very cool cover here. And also to mention the title, we learned that our main character is actually studying to beco become a doctor. So I thought that was a kind of cool play on words. Uh, Dr. Fate being a real doctor, who knew? Uh, and it seems like, because I'm not a big, you know, Dr. Fate fan, it seems like they're introducing a new character here. Um, not really sure about that, because again, not really big on Dr. Fate, but uh, let's see what's going on with the story. Uh, but first, let's talk about the artwork. I will say the artwork is very unique, and it was kind of hard to get used to um, for the story. It's not, you know, it's not bad artwork, it's just very unique artwork. And uh, I don't know if everyone will like this style, but, uh, I think uh, as the book goes on, you get pretty much used to it if you like the story. So let's see what I thought about the story. So with this issue, we get to see that there's this guy named Khalid, and uh, he's starting to be a doctor. He's kind of happy with his, with his life. Um, but, then, but then he has this cat telling him, wear this helmet, wear this helmet. And he's finally tempted to wear the helmet. Uh, and he's a good guy, and you know he proves that he's a good guy throughout the issue. Uh, and then he wears the helmet, and now he's not going to be able to take it off because we know with the Doctor Fate helmet, it pretty much tempts you to wear, and sometimes makes you not take off the helmet. But uh, yeah, it seems like we're going to see uh, our new Doctor Fate here, and it's just the beginning of a story with issue one. Um, what did I think about this? Again, I got this book pretty much on whim. I'm not a huge Dr. Fate fan, but with all these issue ones, I want to try to give um, all of them a good shot. You know, and Dr. Fate is a character that I've always wanted to, you know, read more about. Uh, and with this issue, it was okay. I, I think it's interesting, again, that this character wants to be a doctor, but uh, it didn't make me really interested in the Dr. Fate mythos, I would say. It doesn't really explore the mythos either. It's kind of weird because you have this random cat, He's like, oh, well, you were, you know, descendant of the pharaohs, so now you have to, um, you know, become Dr. Fate. So I wish they kind of explained the mythos of Dr. Fate a bit more here, but I liked how they dug into um, our main character, Khalid. Uh, but there wasn't too much here to hook me for the next issue. Again, this is just me, you know, not being a big Dr. Fate fan or Magic fan, so that's why I didn't fully enjoy it, but definitely not a bad issue. So overall, I'll give Dr. Fate issue one three stars. It's not a bad issue, and I think if you like the mystical side of DC, you'll actually really enjoy this issue. For me, it just wasn't totally my taste, and I don't know if I'll get the next issue, but again, I'm glad I tried the first issue. So if you guys enjoyed, this is Comic Uno. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, description below there's links for my comic book like father like daughter and don't forget to like the facebook page of like father like daughter i'll see you guys later bye